If you want to start editing your motion and being really precise with things, what we're going to do now is press new tracking, select a shape and I'm going to click on this player now. So firstly let's choose a colour that we want and I'm going to press spacebar to start moving. Now if I go frame by frame for wood with M, I can be really particular about moving this tracking onto that player if I needed to. So this is useful as I go forwards and I can check things here. At this point if I've gone too far forwards, so I don't need that tracking there, I'm going to press N to go back and make sure this is on the player. And then in this scenario I actually want to finish the spotlight here. So I'm going to press S on my keyboard which is the same as pressing stop tracking. So now we have that element that shows. But within this spotlight you can use some useful tips and tricks here. So if I bring back the playhead to this point, now if I wanted to change the colour from yellow I select it here and I can press red. And I can press spacebar to move on. I could select it again and now press blue. So what this means when we watch this back is if I play from here, we go from the original yellow colour, then to red, then to blue.